First, if your screen doesn't work, you should check this place. There's a gap between these two parts, but uh, you should check that these two parts are fit perfectly. There's no large gap between them. And then we are telling you the right way to turn on the display. First, this key is just only for lock the battery. And then after you lock the battery, you just press the, the power button. And after the power button is turned, the light is on, you press the middle button for th at least three seconds. And then your display will be turned on successfully. But if you do as our, our follows and your display still doesn't work, you should check this place. You press the button and you will find that there are four lights. And if the lights, if you only can see one red smallest red, uh, light, which means the battery need be charged. And if you can see more than two lights, which means there are some problems with the battery. And you should check the output voltage of the battery. And at this time, you need a voltage tester. And before you test the voltage, output voltage, you should keep the battery is turned on. And you can adjust the voltage tester to this, as we pointed out. And do as our stops are showing. And now you can see uh, the voltage is 37.7, .7, which means our this e-bikes battery has no problem, but if your test result is zero, which is means that your fuse wire has some problem, and if your test result is under uh, 32, which is means that your battery has no power, then you should be, you should charge your battery at, for at least five hours, and then you can test it again. And if your test result is uh, over 32, which means you need to check another part, which is the controller. But before you check the controller, you should replace the battery on the right place. And this wire is the wire that connects the battery and the controller and you can see two red and black wires and you also use the voltage tester to test out the voltage and normally it will come out two results the first is that it shows nothing or zero which means that these two wires have some problem and if your result is similar to the previous uh, test the results as you were testing the batteries, which means you should test another part. And another part is still also in the controller. This uh, there are five wires and you should be testing out the black wire and the red wire and still there will always be two results one is the it shows zero which means the controller has some problem and if you still have the similar results as you were testing out the battery, 
it means that your display or screen might have some problem. And that's all, thank you.